It does sound like we might have ourselves a hillbilly. Hello, buddy. Do you know I'm here? Do you have lethal pursuer? It does look like he does. Let's go ahead and sprint burst away. We're not going to stop at this tile. We'll take him at least one more. He's not chainsawing for distance, so that's good. We'll go ahead and loop him right around here. Just keep these in between us and him. We're going to greet it this time just to see how he reacts. Nice little respect there. Let's drop it, see if we can get the stun. No, he respected again. All right, that's definitely something to keep in mind. This man likes to respect pallets. All right, we're going to go ahead and greed this then. He's going to go back around. He might actually, okay, I was going to say, he might actually curve around that corner with his chainsaw, but that isn't what happened. Little spin for the boys. That did not work at all. I honestly had higher hopes for that, but that did not work at all. Are you going to break this hillbilly? Are you, my friend? I think he's going to break it right now. Perfect. It was either that or he's going to try to curve, and I haven't seen him try to curve yet. We'll make this window just fine. And it looks like he looped back around, so we'll bring him to this pallet here. See, this is why I love Windows of Opportunity. You can change your pathing and your plans so quickly to, to whatever's nearby because you know exactly what's nearby. Hello, Billy. You're still not chainsawing for distance, which I guess I find a little bit interesting. We've got another strong pallet here. No! No! All right, well, we will try not to run into any more walls in the future. Hello, buddy. Wow, you didn't actually swing with that sprint burst. That is some discipline right there. We're going to have to drop that. He's a little too close. He is going to break it with his chainsaw. So we've got a decent amount of distance. Let's just go ahead and bring him all the way to the next tile. We'll kind of space out our pallet usage here so that we don't create any dead zones, at least not any big dead zones. Let's drop it this time. He's going to use his chainsaw again. That is Lightborn. That is 100% Lightborn. Okay, well, I guess that's good to know so we don't set up for any saves that certainly aren't going to happen. Let's go ahead and greed this again. Ooh, that was actually a little bit close, but now we should make this window just fine. Sorry about that, my friend. He is going to loop around, so let's wait at the corners. Oh, we messed up. Oh, no, we're going to have to spin for the boys here. This hillbilly has not been so easy to spin. He's been easy to loop, but definitely got his eye on you when you try to spin him. I cannot tell where this man is at. Oh, hello, hillbilly. I keep running into you when I don't really want to, although I suppose you chasing me is not too bad. Wow, I cannot spin this man. I just need to stop trying because it's obviously not working. And we're basically just giving him free health states, although, you know, we were going to get hit anyway. That's kind of the point of the spin, right? Let's go ahead and drop this. Hey, we actually got the stun that time. Very nice. We'll move away. Just had to double check that that was Lightborn. And it is. So we're not going to get any saves, which is a little unfortunate, but I honestly don't think we really need them. This is a terrible pallet. I'm just going to go ahead and go straight through this window here, and we'll use this really bad window to space us out. I don't think I actually have enough distance. One more spin, Claudette? Okay. The spins are a waste of time. We need to stop trying to do the spins. We might be able to block for him here. If he uses his chainsaw, we're dead, but... All right, you know what, Jane? I, I kind of I kind of blame you there. All right, well... No, I was going to say it, it was my fault because I didn't do the flashlight save there, but he has Lightborn, so it's not my fault. She's going to go set up for a sabotage, although it looks like he's trying to carry him to a really far hook. I don't know if he's going to make it, if we're going to be able to stop him here. Oh, very nice. It looks like she would have made it to that hook in time anyway. She saved us with the sabotage play early on. That's why we didn't get our first hook state, so she's been doing pretty awesome. He is going to take his chainsaw around. Be careful, my friend. Very nice, Dwight. Let's try to get in between them. Ah! GG. Moving on. We're just going to try to stay nearby for the flashlight save here, depending on who he goes for. It looks like he is going to try to commit to the Michaela, so... Let's try to take his attention. Hello, Wesker. Would you like to loop around one of my favorite maps to loop? Mainly because of these cars, Wesker. Come over here. Come play with the cars with me. Very nice respect there. I don't think he's going to respect again, though. This man seems pretty intelligent. Let's go ahead and drop that. We know he's going to vault it, so we'll just preemptively start our way around. Go away, Wesker. I don't want to play with you. He did not fall for that fake. Or that spin. Our spins are terrible today. Maybe we should just give up on the spins. I don't know. We do have ourselves another nice little car here. 
And you know that Weskers love to use their powers on those straightaways, but we did manage to loop around in time. Not all Weskers can be looped like that, by the way. Some of them are very fast and very accurate with their, uh, with their rushes, and they will catch you before you make it around, but it's always nice to see if you're playing against one of those or not. You should have broke this pallet earlier, Wesker. We're gonna hit him with another blind here. And see if we can't make it to another safe pallet. We've got one over here next to the van. Perfect. Come, Wesker. Continue to chase the Claudette. Oh, that was a nice mind game there. Ooh, he got us good. Let's just stay... Okay, I was gonna say let's just stay nearby again, but he... He immediately saw us, which is unfortunate. We probably should have just let him hook Jeff since we've been hooked once, but... We are kind of going for our 5 gen chase still, so I feel like as long as he doesn't hook anybody else, it still counts, right? Jeff, you need to leave, my friend. You need to go. I wanted to take him to this down pallet so that I didn't use another one, but I wasn't expecting you to be here. I'm just gonna have to leave. It's better for us to leave than to have both of us here. Oh, and he's actually coming after me. You know what? That works out. I will take it. Come, Wesker. We'll go ahead and use this window. He just used his power, so we know he can't vault it immediately, which should give us enough time to wrap all the way back around to this pallet. And Jeff is gone, so we can loop it much more comfortably. Come, Wesker. We're going to go ahead and... Oh, I was going to actually vault it this time because he, uh, he didn't fall for the fake last time, but he doubled back. Very nice. And he doesn't seem to have a very good set of ears on him. I don't know if he's playing without headphones, but he is definitely... Losing track of us with every blind. We're going to take that hit. But it's going to put the window in between us and him. So we're going to get even more distance than if we had taken a hit out in the open. Hello, Jeff. I think Jeff is going to go take our chase for us. That's all the generators. Now we just need to hopefully get Nia out of here alive. Hello, Wesker. <laughs> Pay no attention to the Nia running away. Okay, he's definitely going for Nia. I don't think we can take this chase from him. Nope. She has made it to the safe van pallet, though, so she should be fine for a little while, and we might still be able to get the save on him. You know what? It's probably better if we just go out and take the hit, right? The door is open. Maybe she'll make it. She does have the speed uh, debuff, so I'm not sure she's actually going to make it. But maybe. If Jeff would get out of the snowman and actually block, he might actually pick her up there. GG, Wesker. We'll just hide in this little snowman and maybe pop out and get a save? Oh no, she wants to use the snowman. I'm sorry, my friend. I was in there. You can't use it. We'll just stay nearby. Hello, Ghostface. I need to stop saying we're going to stay nearby. Because every time that comes out of my mouth, the killer shows up. Oh, I think he's actually... Yeah. Maybe if he picks up facing away from the hay bale, we've got this. But it doesn't look like he did. That's unfortunate. We were probably a little too late anyway, to be honest. We're gonna have to go in for the save here since they're being chased. Oh, he's gonna go down. Okay, I don't think he saw us because of the corn, and I know we're blind, but muscle memory is gonna help us out there. Perfect, sorry about that, ghosty. We'll hit him with another blind so that they can get the save a little more safely. And he's going back. He's not committing to us, which is a little unfortunate. Oh, they didn't get the save. What is this witchcraft? Why didn't you get the save, my friend? No, maybe they didn't think they had enough time. And maybe they didn't, I'm not sure. But now we should have enough time to go get it. Come here, my friend. I know that it hasn't worked out, but we're just going to stay nearby. And hopefully that doesn't automatically cause us to get chased like it has every other time I've said it. Oh, he lost her. Oh, why did you loop back into him? No, you were doing so good. But I think he's going to face this direction. Perfect. Sorry about this ghost face. There you go, you get a second chance. You make a tiny little mistake, you get a chance to do it over. Now we should have his attention now, right? This man has gotten three hook states at five gens, so we really need to have him on us so we can take him for a little bit of a chase. I think he got a little lost in the corn there. Hello, ghosty. There he is. How are you, my friend? We're going to loop back around to this window. What you doing, buddy? Maybe he got confused. Maybe he didn't think I'd wrapped back around. I'm not sure what this ghost face is doing. He's definitely behaved a little bit weirdly. He's still back there. I don't know if he knows where we are, but he's definitely still back there. Did we get away? It's really hard to tell when he goes into stealth. I have no idea where he's at. Oh, there he is. He's still creeping around the back. Let's go ahead and break him out. I'm not 100% sure how close we are to being stalked, but that was terrible. I should have just kept running. 
That was a really, really bad attempt at a spin or an FOV tech. I'm not really sure. He is going to wrap around, so we'll loop back to the pallet. We're going to greet it since he's a little ways back there. Stop at the corner, look for the red light. There he is. We should make this window just fine. Sorry about that, ghosty. He's wrapping around again, so we're going to wait at the corner. Ghostface, I think you actually kind of had me there. I think you mind-gamed yourself there. If he had continued around the corner, I think he would have got me. God, it's so hard to tell. I can't tell if he's still on us. We have looped him for two gens, though, so... We are evening out the odds just a bit. If we can just keep him on us for a bit longer, I think we'll be in good shape. We're just going to drop this, stick him on that side of it, hit him with the blind, and then try to make it to another tile. There we go. We got a pallet over there. That should work just fine. Come, Ghostface. Stay on us, my friend. I really would like you to stay on us. This is a huge loop, so we're going to greet it a little bit more than we have the last ones. I'm not going to camp the pallet, my friend. That's not what Claudette is about. We are going to drop it this time, though, and I guess we're going to loop around again instead. Never mind. He doubled back again. Okay, we're just going to drop it. Let's go ahead and break him out of stealth real quick so we know where he's at while we're running away. We've got another tile here that hasn't been used. Let's turn around and go right back through the window. That usually throws them off a little bit. Hello, ghosty. We are going to drop this pallet this time. Man, he is respecting like crazy. Oh, he didn't break it. Let's go ahead and... Loop back around to the window then. Although I have kind of lost him. There he is. Hello, ghosty. He double backed again. Let's wait at the corner here just in case. He double backed again. All right, that should actually give us enough distance to make it to the TNL walls here. Although we don't make this window, we're going to have to fake it. Perfect. Let's go ahead and use this one instead. And since he swung, we're going to capitalize on that and try to make it to something else. Although, to be honest, I don't have anything. We have a window in here, but he's so close. Okay. That was interesting. We're going to make this now. Okay, that probably should have hit there. That was a little strange. But I am going to go ahead and take it since we are still alive. And we've looped him for three gens now, although it looks like he might be giving up. I'm not sure where he went. Hello, ghosty. I was looking for you because I didn't want you to down Leon without me nearby, but... Going on another chase works as well, my friend. We're going to take him on over to the Harvester. Again, I see he hasn't downed anybody else. He still only has the three hook states, so I am counting this as a five gen run here. Why did you swing at that, my friend? That's going to give us time to get away. We do have another pallet off to our right here. So let's go ahead and utilize that. We are going to greet it a little bit. For a second, I thought that tree was a fat shame for him, but it's not. Let's drop it here. Man, those respects are massive, you would think. Oh my god, I, I didn't realize that I was out of flashlight. That was a little bit of a surprise. I'm really glad we didn't go for a save. We do have built to last, though, so if we can break this chase, perfect. We'll be able to charge our flashlight back up. Let's fast vault out and hopefully catch his attention. Okay, he is going to get Leon here, most likely. I don't think we can count this as a 5 gen run anymore since he's gotten more downs, but... Pretty sure we can get this save. Perfect. It's been a while, so he's not paranoid. Sorry about that, ghost face. We didn't manage to get Leon that time, though. Sorry about that, Leon. We still have one more gen to go. Oh, he put him down. Man, some people are doing some crazy Sabo plays. Either that or he just put him down because he's mad at me. I can't really tell. Get a little FOV. Nope. They're not going to be able to finish that heal in time. Let's sprint burst away. That's a wall. Oh, crap. Well... He's not having it anymore. I think we have overstayed our welcome in Ghostface game. Meg, no! Meg, no! That was a really weird unhook. Does he actually pick up here? He does. Oh, Ghostface, you're going to hate me by the end of this, my friend. I'm so sorry. I have to repay her for saving me, though. We'll hit him with another blind so she can get away. There's no way he lets me go. right? Yeah, no, he's still back there. He's definitely not going to let us go. We do have the shack, though. So, we could probably loop him around here for quite a while. Ghostface, you're doing a lot of double backing, my friend. Okay, there he goes. He's going out this time. Let's... God, I should... Oh, they finished the generators. I was going to say I should probably stay at the shack, but we can take him over to the harvester, and we should be just fine. Megan, I really wish you weren't here, but... Let's go... Um... Huh. I... <laughs> I don't remember what this perk is called. 
But we are screwed. <laughs> Both injured people are trapped up here. No, Ghostface, no. Thank you for that, Leon. I honestly didn't think anybody was going to come for us. Oh, we should have stayed. We might have been able to get that save. Everybody has made it out. Hello, Ghostface. It's just you and me now, my friend. After having three hooks and five gens at the beginning, it looks like I might actually be the only one that dies. We do have our sprint burst recharging, though. So if we can bait him up here... And then maybe... Oh crap, he went around. Okay, let's hope we run in the right direction here. Please let the door be over here. If it's over here, we make it. If not, we're dead. Oh, we messed up. It's not over here. I have no idea where the doors are at. Oh no. Well, we definitely die here. I can't even find the hatch. I thought maybe the hatch would be at the shack, but nope. We are definitely going to die to the entity. GG, Ghostface. I am sorry about all that trouble I put you through. Hello, buddy. I actually lost you there for a second. GG, my friend. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to leave a like to help this video reach more eye holes and subscribe for more because there's always going to be more. Until next time, bye for now.